Sergeant Hamrick, how was the skeleton discovered? It was discovered by members of the railroad section crew who were working along the track uh, in the area approximately one half mile south of McMeckin. Uh, that would be between McMeckin and Glendale. They saw what appeared to be a skull there on the road bank between the highway and the railroad and uh, so reported it to the uh, depot uh, officials in Moundsville and they in turn called us. Uh, we went to the scene and uh, uh, made a search and uh, found the skull, what appears to be a human skull and uh, several bones of what appears to be bones of a human body. Did you find anything at the scene other than the skeleton? Uh, some fragments of clothing that uh, appear to be a part of female clothing. Uh, however, that is assumption. Have you been able to make any uh, positive determinations yet in your investigation? Have not. We have not. Are you investigating the possibility that this may be uh, Isabel Butchko, who has been missing since 1963? Uh, yes, sir. She uh, is a missing person from this area and uh, under such a circumstance when something like this comes up we of course always uh, check to see whether or not uh, these bones uh, might be those of any missing person from this area. Just from your own visible, uh, visual observation, uh, did the remains indicate to you there might have been foul play? There is nothing uh, about the bones to indicate any foul play. However, uh, that does not rule out the possibility that there might have been foul play. <laughs> 